Welcome, Bronco fans, to the second week of Western Michigan Spring Football and the Spring Practice Report. We're here, as always, with Coach Fleck. Coach, I always ask you what the team and what the coaches learned today, but how did the team change today? Well, I think they, uh, you know, we went outside, we were in pads, we had our first day of tackle, and I thought they uh, did a great job of coming out and just just executing what we asked them to do. I thought that, um, you know, we, I think we changed in a way that we understand how valuable the ball really is. And we have a saying here, the ball is the program. And I think our players finally realized that today, and uh, both offensively, defensively, and special teams. I think we saw it in a lot of areas. Yeah, I'm glad you mentioned that because that was actually something I was going to bring up. You have a period in each practice where you work on ball disruption. How many different ways can you affect these guys in practice to make them understand that the ball is the program? Well, if you think about it, you label something as the program, and the program's everything. It's us, it's the administration, it's the community, it's the present, it's the past, it's the future of Bronco football, it's everything. And when we put that ball on the ground, or, or we, we don't scoop and score on defense, or you know, we miss the block punt by an inch, um, we affect the program with everything we do there. So if they can understand that the ball is the program, but they have to understand what the program is first. So we have a ball disruption, ball security circuit every single day. And uh, if you're not doing it every day, how can it be the program? And we want to understand that if we're doing it every single day, that's how important it is. We're going to be talking with Clark Musman a little later. The tight end, to me, is a unique position. In this offense and in your mind, it, how is the tight end important in the Western Michigan offense? Well, I think it's very valuable. I think you know we're going to run the football, uh, we're going to throw the football, and we're going to do everything we possibly can to score the score score the points we need to score. The, the tight end is very critical in that. You know, he's got to be a guy that can line up and block a six technique, but also stretch the field vertically. And um, the guys we have with with Musman and, and Boyden and uh, I can go on and on with our tight ends who are performing very well right now. Um, yeah, I'm really proud with the progress they've made, but they're a very integral part of what we're trying to do offensively. Final question. We're in now to week two. Um, as you say, we're, we're learning every day. What, as we get into preparation for the first scrimmage, what specifically do you want to see from offense, defense, and special teams? I just want to see change. You know, I want to see change. I mean, I, we could be here five hours if I told you everything we wanted to change in. Um, the way we walk, the way we talk, the way we act, the way we put our hands on our hips if we're tired. We don't do that. Uh, just every little integral part of practice, there's something small that we expect from each other. And as humans, we forget that. Um, you know, trained behavior becomes instinct. It's something we say around here. So it's my job to make sure I train the behavior that we want and then allow it to become instinct on the field. And they've got to do it this, the same way. So I think we're just trying to look at how have we progressed in all areas, all phases, from technique to assignments to how we get to drill to drill, from our discipline, our eyes. Um, I told you we could be here five hours. We told you everything we need to work on. But uh, I think as we sit there and look at where we're going, I think um, you know we'll be elite eventually. And I think our players are, are really buying in. All right, thank you, Coach. Next up, we'll have senior tight end Clark Musman talking about his role in the uh, Western Michigan offense coming in 2013. We're back with senior tight end Clark Musman. Clark, kind of an interesting story with you because you had the opportunity, you graduated, but you decided to come back. Just talk a little bit about the process you went through, talking with your family and, and so on. Uh, yeah, like you said, I had the opportunity to graduate uh, in April, so I decided that football was important, but getting a scholar, or, uh, degree is much more important. So I took that opportunity, and then I decided I was going to graduate. And then I heard they were getting Coach Fleck in and decided to go to the press conference, and I met him. And I realized he's a great guy, would be a great coach, and I wanted to play under him for one year. The tight end unit as a whole is kind of unique, at least to me, because you're a pass catching option, you're a blocking force, you're kind of an extension of that offensive line. How do you see the tight end um, as a position? Uh, like you said, we're just all over the place. We can be in the backfield, on the line, spread out, number one receiver. I just see us as like a utility player. Like if we're needed somewhere, then we'll go take that position and do it the best of our ability. In a game, what is, I'm going to ask you more fun for you, blowing up someone on the other side of the ball to block for a running back or, you know, catching a, a seam route? Uh, I'd say catching a seam route just because I'm selfish and I want to get yards and catches, but 
getting a block to open a hole for a running back is a great feeling too when you see him just take off down the sideline for 60 yards or a touchdown. It's great to know that you caused that block to spring that play. I talked with Coach Fleck in one of our last episodes how it's kind of unique how we have our tight ends coach and our offensive line coach working with both groups. How has it been working with both uh, Coach Callahan and Coach Kenny? Uh, it's going pretty good. Mostly I'm with Coach Kenny now, but the tackles and tight ends are a unit kind of and the centers and guards. So we work together as a team. Obviously, we're on the line, so we have to know everything that the lineman's doing. We have to communicate with them, be on the same side as them. And so we're working pretty good as a unit, and I think it's going to be a good season. Final question. Coach Fleck is adamant about us learning something every day. What did you learn today? What I learned today, uh, stay mentally tough, stay focused in the play at hand, uh, forget the past, and just keep playing forward. All right, thanks, Clark. For Clark Musman and Coach Fleck, thanks for watching the Western Michigan Football Spring Practice Report. Row the boat.